स्टडी आई क्यू अब तैयारी हुई अफोर्डेबल बिल्कुल उम्मीद नहीं थी कि आप लोग इतने इतने दूर से आए हैं और मुझे अब एक भी मिनट वक्त खराब नहीं करना चाहिए तो फॉर्मली इस पूरे सेमिनार की शुरुआत करते हैं वेलकम टू ऑल ऑफ यू बहुत बहुत स्वागत है आपका इस पूरे स्टूडेंट मीटअप में हमारे साथ जो खास मेहमान हैं वो हैं आई ए एस विवेक केवी सर मैं सबसे पहले नम्रता जो मेंटोर हैं हमारी उनको बुलाऊंगा और नमस्ता बुके प्रेजेंट करें सर को देखिए आप तो बहुत दूर दूर से आए हैं बहुत तेज तेज ताली बजाइए और आप सबकी तरफ से स्टडी आई की तरफ से बहुत स्वागत है विवेक केवी सर का इन्होंने 2019 में फाइनली यू गॉट सिलेक्शन इन हाँ 19 में सिलेक्शन 20 बैच 20 बैच तो 20 बैच है इनका लेकिन उससे पहले इनकी जर्नी उसी तरीके से रही जैसा आप टेक्स्ट में देखते हैं मतलब ग्राफ जिगजैग रहा जिगजैग रहा मतलब नॉट इन वेरी फर्स्ट अटेम्प्ट ही हैज क्लियर्ड ऐसा नहीं है उसके पहले बहुत सारी चीज़ें ऐसी हुई बहुत सारी वैसी चीज़ें हुई जो आज आपके साथ हो रही कहने का मतलब ये है कि आज जितने तरह की प्रॉब्लम्स आप फेस करते हैं सोचते हैं जितने तरह से डीमोटिवेट होते हैं वो सब कुछ इनके साथ हो चुका है दो बार प्रिलिम्स क्लियर नहीं हुआ एक बार एक बार एक बार कट कर एक बार का कट कर लेते हैं एक बार प्रिलिम्स क्लियर नहीं हुआ एक बार सिलेक्शन हुआ तो आई नहीं मिला ठीक है पर फाइनली दो में जाकर सलेक्शन हुआ और उसके पहले भी एक आई के स्टूडेंट को जिसके पास बहुत बड़ा पैकेज रहता है साम, सामने मैं ठीक कह रहा हूँ yeah. जिसको लोग ऑफर करते हैं कि भाई आके मेरे यहाँ काम कर लो उसके सामने सबसे बड़ी दुविधा क्या होगी सबसे बड़ा डिलेमा क्या होगा कि भाई सामने का की थाली को छोड़कर तैयारी करनी है जो कि अनसर्टेन है जो अनसर्टेनिटी का सवाल और प्रॉब्लम आप लोग के मन में आता है वो भी बहुत बड़ी प्रॉब्लम है तो इस पूरी जर्नी के बारे में हम सबसे पहले सर से ही पूछेंगे तो सबसे पहले मैं एक ब्रीफ जर्नी चाहता हूं जो आप स्टूडेंट्स के साथ शेयर कीजिए हाय आई एम विवेक मैं मिक्स करूंगा ठीक है डोंट वरी आई एम फ्रॉम केरला बेसिकली आई एम फ्रॉम केरला आई डिड माय एंटायर स्कूलिंग इन केरला वहीं से हूं आई लाइक फर्स्ट माय 17 18 इयर्स आई बीन केरला ओनली देन आई शिफ्टेड टू एन आई टी ट्रिची फॉर बी टेक आई हैव एन इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स एंड कम्युनिकेशन इंजीनियरिंग फ्रॉम एन आई टी After which I wrote CAT and cleared it. I went to uh, I am Calcutta. I am a uh, 2015 batch pass out of I am Calcutta. I was here in Gurgaon. I got placed in Samsung. I took that placement because I wanted to prep also. So here I was in Samsung. So then I used to go to Chanakya. At that time uh, there was no option here. I said in Gurgaon there was nothing for prep. So I went to Chanakya. There was no Satya Niketan. I think it's the North Campus, South Campus. What is it? South Campus. So I used to go there in front of that Venki College. Is this? So Saturday and Sunday I, I was I used to go there and learn. Then in 2017 I gave my first prelims. I did not clear. I left my job in 2017 and I shifted to uh, Rajendra Nagar obviously. And then I gave my 2018 attempt, uh, which I got an Indian Railway Account Services. Then I wrote again and got into IAS. Uh, I am currently an MP Carter officer. I have done my. Foundation. I've done my phase one. I've done my phase two. What happens after phase two is basically, आपको एक बार central deputation का एक appetizer type देने के लिए आपको यहाँ तीन महीने assistant secretary level पे post किया जाता है. तो अलग-अलग मंत्रालय में post करते हैं. मैं वित्त मंत्रालय में हूँ. I'm in the finance ministry. I look at the department of expenditure. So that's why I'm here. Then I got an opportunity to come and meet you. So hi. और आगे बढ़े उससे पहले विवेक जी के कुछ काम हैं जो हम लोग देखेंगे और इन्हीं की जुबानी समझेंगे 
इस स्क्रीन पर स्क्रीन इसीलिए लगाया गया है इतना बड़ा आप लोग सोच रहे होंगे ना कि स्क्रीन पर क्या चलने वाला है तो स्क्रीन पर वो पीपीटी शेयर कीजिए और उसके बारे में जो भी ब्रीफ करना होगा सर करेंगे सो ब्रीफली अबाउट वॉट दिस इज तो वंस यू फिनिश योर फाउंडेशन कोर्स आप जब फाउंडेशन कोर्स खत्म करोगे देन यू गो टू योर डिस्ट्रिक्ट तो मुझे मिला था भिंड डज एनी वन नो भिंड या आई वॉज थ्रोन टू भिंड लेट से दैट ओनली दिस इज द रेवाइन बेल्ट इट्स अ वेरी डिफिकल्ट स्पेस टू वर्क तो दिस इज माई वर्क फॉर वन ईयर मैं वहाँ पे एक साल काम किया हूँ उसमें आई वॉज अ सी एम ओ ऑफ भिंड नगर पालिका देन आई वॉज एन एस डी एम इन महगाव एंड देन एन एस डी एम इन लाहौर सो आई वॉज एस डी एम फॉर सेवन मंथ्स एंड अ सी एम ओ फॉर थ्री मंथ्स इट्स ऑलमोस्ट ऑल माई वर्क कंपाइल फ्राम देर सो आई हैपन टू बी काइंड ऑफ एन ओके फोटोग्राफर सो आई हैव फोटोज फ्राम दैट प्लेस दिस इज माई फोटोग्राफी मेन टू फोटो बुक द नगर पालिका भिंड हैड पब्लिश दिस थिंग एम जस्ट गिविंग यू अ स्लाइज ऑफ वॉट काइंड ऑफ वर्क यू एक्सपेक्टिंग आफ्टर क्लियरिंग दिस right see one of the most important thing why we come to the exam why why we come to this space is the, is the is the diversity of work right isliye to hum aaye hain matlab kya opportunities to bahut hai hamare paas you uh, most of us are young and you have a lot of opportunities and the country is growing the private is giving you so much in ter- in terms of money in terms of benefits right it's not like 1980s anymore uh, the technology has thrown in so much in uh, the the management kind of a space also has a lot of opportunities to work in and very interesting spaces startups are coming up right so why would you come is time maybe jab uh, uh, when the opportunities are becoming limitless why would you come to this job that is the idea right and most of us come because one i came because of boredom i got bored in samsung and i know another atel or vodafone or anywhere where i shift it will be same so i came to kind of kill my boredom and the kind of diversity of work i wanted to do and the kind of ground level impact i wanted to make because when you're working i worked at nsdm for 7 months you say something the next day it gets gets done and it's very physical aisa nahi ki corporate mein aap kaam kar rahe ho kuch ho nahi raha ho raha hai bhai aisa nahi hai i worked in the i worked in samsung and i did a, a pretty good work there i created a product from nothing so here also that happens but at a faster a faster level one secondly you have immediate gratification people appreciate your work if you are someone i hope i hope everyone is like that कि हमें अच्छा लगता है कि और लोग हमारी वर्क की तारीफ करें एंड दैट इज दिस जॉब पीपल यू हैव लॉट ऑफ रेस्पेक्ट हियर यू हैव लॉट ऑफ अपॉर्चुनिटी टू वर्क सो व्हाट आई एम ट्राइंग टू शो यू इज दिस इज समथिंग आई कुड डू जस्ट इन प्रोबेशन दैट इज व्हाट एट मंथ्स आउट ऑफ द ट्वेल्व मंथ्स यू आर इन द डिस्ट्रिक्ट थ्री मंथ्स इज सीटन बाई योर ए यू हैव टू गो टू भोपाल एंड ट्रेन यूर इन द मोड्स एंड वेस एंड रेवेन्यू लॉस ऑफ द स्टेट अदरवाइज यू हैव अटैच टू डिस्ट्रिक्ट कलेक्टर सो दिस इज माई वर्क एज माई वेन माई इंडिपेंडेंट चार्जेस स्टार्ट so this is a guy who came so uh, briefly about bind briefly about bind bind is a uh, uh, do you know does anyone know anything about bind can someone explain uh, why is it famous or notorious for that matter koi nahi hai bind se bhopal se to koi hai kaise nahi janega bind ke bare mein batao tum isiliye bind kahi ja nahi raha hai so this is a ravine belt you know ravines right chambal ravines so almost all the dakets were here they were dakati for 2 3 dakets which has been brought down by efforts of the state uh, now also it's underdeveloped right so i was posted here for a year this is my work from there so basically this is my collector so what happens to you once you go as a uh, uh, assistant collector you you called an assistant collector once you get through the exam and your first posting so you work with the collector that's my collector that's my sp that's another ips officer who is a commandant battalion commandant of a battalion there you might know him he is amit tulani sir it's pretty famous so this is bins uh, uh, nazri naksha so this is my uh, this is these are people i worked with and this is the state of affairs in bind these are the urban areas in bind you can see how difficult a life it is there and you are sent as solutions to this right so that is why we are here we are here so that these kind of problems can be solved these are foundational problems these are not any these are foundational this is something that you step step out of your house and see this and you can't live like that people are living and you have been entrusted with power and the capability and the and you already have that potential to change this and we have to go and change this and that is our work and if you are interested in this work this is a wonderful place to come in right so you see that picture and this is uh, i was i was the cmo uh, initially i got the chief municipal officer that's what a cmo is it is the head of the nagarpalika there uh, just giving you a brief i didn't know all this i i came to know only after i went there so this is the state of affairs so then we started work and this is my work so every day morning i used to go it's you can go any time and the entire uh, staff would come with you 
इट्स नॉट दैट आप आओगे फिर आपको वेट करना पड़ेगा आपके स्टाफ के लिए नहीं आप हो मतलब एटलीस्ट इन दीज कार्डर्स आई कैन से दैट अबाउट एवरी अदर कार्डर इन दी एम पी कार्डर द डी एम वेक्स अप द ऑफिस स्टार्ट दैट्स आओ राइट एंड दैट्स आओ दैट्स वाई दिस एग्जाम इज इंपॉर्टेंट दैट्स वाई यू अंडरस्टैंड वॉट पावर यू हैव द मोमेंट यू वेक अप द सी एम ओ द ऑल योर नगर पालिका स्टाफ हैज टू बी विथ यू सो वी गो फॉर इंस्पेक्शन देर आर लाइक थर्टी नाइन वार्ड्स वी डिवाइड दोज वार्ड्स एंड गो फॉर इंस्पेक्शन एंड ट्राई एंड फाइन स्पेस वेर दर आर इश्यूज विच कैन बी डेल टू दैन वी क्लीन इट सो दिस इज फ्रॉम इनिशियल पार्ट ऑफ माई वर्क so that's how it was and that's what we made it and then there are other issues these are these are all the work i've done as uh, uh, part of nagarpalika we clean drain we clean drains after drains after drains we clean uh, we ran a uh, swachhata abhiyan and this is all you can do by your own one morning you wake up you say, decide that i'm going to clean the city you can go and clean the city you have all the resources you have two three jcbs with you you have so much staff with you and you walk on the road right there's jcb behind you so much stuff it's a spectacle If you really like it and you're changing, you get that attention. I, I like attention. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with it. Huh? Getting attention, fine. That really uh, gets into your work. So this is my work. As uh, I'm just going through faster. So this is all the and this is also street photography. I do a bit of street photography. The aesthetics of it. Uh, this is bind. It's beautiful. It's beautiful in its own way. Like a lot of people think that bind is very you know it's raw. It's raw. It's very authentic. It's raw. It's very pretty difficult. It's hot in June. It gets gets to 49 degrees Celsius. for an entire month people fall ill but there's also beauty there this all the kind of house construction because i was an outsider i came from kerala i could not understand this so i always took pictures these are people i worked with this is all that only i'm just going through it fast this is a market this is old and then after that i got a charge as an sdm uh, in mehgaon so what happens so once you become an sdm you have an entire subdivision under your control so that would enter as there are multiple cmos working for you are at a level higher so you look at panchayats you look at uh, urban development you look at rural development you look at revenue loss ex essentially your revenue officer i'm just running through it and then uh, this is my work you run a court you see there's no other uh, job that offers you this that you do you sit in a court room in the afternoon in the morning you've gone uh, 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 run around and clean the streets you came back there's a law and order situation you have fought with people you had uh, police helping you and, they, uh, and then solve that law and order issue you come back in the afternoon you run your court there are advocates in front of you throwing law jargon at you that too in hindi right there are people who tell you there is istagaza i don't know i am a mallu right at the end of the day i am from kerala istagaza then ba namantaran batwara uh, simankan i don't know like kurki karenge pata nahi that it's, it's interesting it's interesting it's thrown at you at a pace that it's very difficult to understand but it's really interesting and these are people who taught me actually that's my reader you have a reader and that's a file it's a very old system it's it, it's it's like you're going into antiquity in some sense in a very beautiful manner i really like it you look at the files it's all written in hindi it's very difficult initially but gradually you, you get a hold of laws gradually you start you have arguments with your lawyers then you understand they are also human beings it's okay let's not fight here let's start to try resolving it and your court work also actually decides a lot of things for a lot of people you do two hours in a court at least 100 people's issues are resolved right land see understand in these countries is extremely agricultural and feudal land is everything land is everything because we come from an urban background we don't understand what is the value of land and the moment you do like 10 batwara files amazing that's it you don't have to do innovations and all here so that is the kind of work you do in every day you work there is so many lives getting resolved and the satisfaction is also there and the prestige and the attention also you get what more do you want that's what this job entails and that's why there's so much competition please understand and these are these are random uh, shots of my work and this is the fertilizer crisis is a long order situation so what happens is the farmers are a very difficult entity to manage i've understood i've never seen farmers in my life because i'm from kerala sorry we couldn't do agriculture there's no land Yeah, that, that's an in, uh, that's an inherent disadvantage of Kerala. I never knew, understood, understood what fertilizer was. I first went and heard DAP, like diammonium phosphate, uh, urea, and people fighting for it. So what should I do? And whenever there's a law and order situation, the SDM has to move. And the, look at the first picture. The, those are farmers who have broken those windows, right? And then the SDM is called upon for. Then I have to understand the entire supply chain of fertilizer. क्या है ये बता नहीं. And what is a fertilizer? When do we use it? What are the fertilizers that is there? What is the stock we have? What is the supply chain of fertilizers? Who are the people creating issues here? Is there political issues here? How do I resolve it? Because fertilizers are required at one point in time. It's a seasonal demand. If I serve it after two months, there's no point, right? The farmers. Then the farmers are on the roads, blocking roads. They immediately block roads. Rail roko andolan. If you have done sociology, I saw it live. they just stop the golier bind road then entire state in crisis it's it's it picked up by the media it's a very difficult uh, entity and a very difficult variable to manage in districts farmers at the same time you understand so much 
you understand basic agriculture to agriculture logistics to fertilizers to how train depots are used for fertilizers what are the companies in fertilizers everything you know if you are an academic person i am and you are in such a space you like doing things the best space you have you have you have a, a bit of an academic angle plus someone you want to change things wonderful space and that is where i've gone to morena and raided godowns i will go i went to another district raided godowns there brought fertilizer and resolved that crisis and wind also has a lot of illegal weapons see understand most of the places you go the law and order situations are very very different so wind has because of the dakati culture the essential idea of dispute resolution has been through violence right and hence the state has the responsibility to end violence between civilians and the violence is a monopoly of the state you understand that and that is the base of all governance and you cannot let your uh, civilians go you know throwing arms at each other so these are uh, the so i've got so certain shots there are a lot of gun shops i've never seen that in kerala my god and the people in my offices from morning they'll come and sit i said what is the issue it's like they are not getting food sir gun chahiye so kyu chahiye chahiye sir <laughs> and they won't say gun they'll say un 19 bindu wala form hai sir matlab 19 bindu wala form kya hai aise bpl hai nahi 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 sir gun hai gun <laughs> sir kyu chahiye chahiye sir and then dhonis uh, binduwala is a 19 point of form where you are supposed to write what all there are certain qualifications you require to get a gun one of them is to have a toilet in the house and there are pictures where you have to put with toilets in the house to show that you have a toilet there are these alpha men are there wanting guns in front of toilets very funny to look at these files right so so this is a shot of the gun shop once you get a license the dm is the one which gives you the license but the sdm forwards the application and as a kerlite like books uh, not guns culture not violence it's 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 it's, it's, it's a quote from uh, dreamers it's a bertolucci movie uh, yeah so that is what i believe in i did not give guns so the, this guy is oja ji oja ji ki bandu ki dukan you can re read it there oja ji oja ji sells guns he's pissed he's always pissed with south indian officers he says that moment a south indian officer comes here our business goes down aap samajhte nahi ho sir यहाँ पे गन की जरूरत है भाई <laughs> चाहिए सर फिर कैसे जिए भाई हमारे पास तो गन है सो ड्यूरिंग इलेक्शन इलेक्शन आई हैव टू कलेक्ट ऑल द गन्स इलीगल गन्स एंड द लाइसेंस गन्स एंड कीप इट इन द स्टोर हाउसेज इन पुलिस स्टेशन दैट इज अनदर लॉजिस्ट आई नेवर सीन इट इन केरला फर्टिलाइजर द फर्टिलाइजर इश्यूज गन इश्यूज इट्स इट्स अमेजिंग दैट्स आई प्लीज टू सर कार्डर आउटसाइड योर स्टेज इट्स अमेजिंग Uh, and these are people look look at the people i deal with i mean these are women they're very the existence is difficult you can't see them they have all kinds of issues what to resolve that is the first question should i resolve health should i resolve education should i resolve livelihood issues i mean yeah where to start is the issue here and these are foundational problems please don't come to the service thinking that you would come create an app and solve people's lives and then you would have a paper covering you about uh, my god this guy has changed through technology no most of the places we are going to land up are having uh, existential issues naale saaf nahi ho rahe that is the issue the issue of drainage and you have to get out i am someone who has a btech from nit i am from i am calcutta and i have worked in samsung but i don't mind going and cleaning nalas and you don't understand why an ias officer a lot of people think that why an ias officer and such a uh, resourceful person is required to open up nalas you don't understand the nala culture there there are people the next house will not let the drainage flow in front of their house hum kyu jaane de band kar diya bhai and everyone else in the nagarpalika is a local and it's a very caste ridden space so they won't go against them so people drown the drainage goes in circles and they invade homes they go in reverse ulti behti hai nali and then they invade houses so you have to go and open them and a bit of and these are muscle spaces you require a bit of intimidation for a subtle kerala it was very difficult initially i be i was nice it didn't work it just doesn't work in some spaces ye bolte hain sir seedhe hain par डिस्ट्रिक्ट चला नहीं पाएंगे सो इट्स अ रियली लर्निंग कर्व फॉर मी आई कम फ्रॉम अ कॉपरेट स्पेस आई कम फ्रॉम केरला वेर देर इज नो इश्यू लाइक दिस पीपल डू इट बाई देम सेल सो आई हैड टू अनलर्न एंड लर्न दिस विच इज रियली नाइस एंड दिस वी हैड फ्लड्स देन इमीडिएटली इफ देर इज अ फ्लड देन इट्स एवरीथिंग यू हैव टू लीव एंड देन वर्क ऑन डिजास्टर मैनेजमेंट वी रन हाउस टू हाउस टू हाउस द रेवेन्यू डज द सर्वे वी अंडल द सर्वे इज कम्पीटेड कम्पीटेड फास्ट एंड द सर्वे रिक्वायर्स हाउ मच लॉस इज देर हाउ मच मॉन्ट्री इशू मॉन्ट्री लॉस इज देर then you have to process it make prakaran put it in the court process it and get them money and that has to be done in two weeks because if i delay that money what is the point people are dying there's hunger right and then you have to run and do this 
leave everything run and do this is flood work these are uh, 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 houses destroyed by flood there were chambal floods in 2020 i was there the people shouting at me and look at them you can't let i mean you can't say anything against them the state of affairs itself tells them they are in a difficult condition they are not they're not faking it and this is after that then there is uh, this is my, my mega experience then i was my my sir was so nice he gave me another subdivision the biggest subdivision in uh, bend it's called lahar uh, i i don't know whether people know it I, I don't think it's on the map. It's a wild, wind is wild, wild west. If you have seen all these, um, uh, who is this? Yeah, Hurt, Dirty Harry and all those movies. It's similar to that in a very vernacular form, right? So this now this is very you 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 can really feel very um, powerful in these jobs. So the entire market was there. There was too much uh, um, encroachment, adhikraman, है ना? तो adhikraman हटाना is an SDM work. So we follow all the procedures. Then I broke the market. For 12 hours continuous, no, not six hours continuous. Sorry, 12. Six hours continuous. From morning we started, and for, uh, we ended up at two or three continuously. We broke. We broke all the encroachments and cleaned it. It's really fun, you know. So you walk. There is an entire army with you. There are two JCBs running behind you. This is it. This is the Simba kind of a thing. Not to that extent. Rochetti is mad, but there is that element. it is very amplified in these movies but there is that element and that element is the biggest issue also and why is it an issue because people really think they are all powerful see this should be done and this has to be done and it has its own tashan na tashan there's no i can't translate tashan tashan is a word with only that, that that i think urdu it's urdu yeah it's very difficult to translate to any other that tashan it has but that tashan has to be diluted and moderated why because in that tashan we go and break things unlawfully and nobody can stop us because in these places dm ne jo bol diya sdm ne jo bol diya sahi hai but the courts won't listen to it there are educated people still there in every place and you will be called upon and unless you do uh, deal the procedure properly even uh, innocence will get affected in this and i had made that i had made a small issue here i i did follow procedure so hence the tashan should always be done following the procedure a procedure has to be followed time has to be given and then only we can do this. right but the tashan exists so please come to the service this is uh, conducting exams sdm has to conduct exams in wind there was a uh, there was something called knuckle tourism I, you understand knuckle right knuckle is copying right i didn't know so i really had to educate my and 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 this and this and this knuckle taro and taro said, sir knuckle hai hame rokna hai hum kya rokna hai hame knuckle sir knuckle <laughs> so kerala it was not an issue ever and then i understood wind had this culture that people came gave wind as the center for examination they'll come here there is a mafia which actually gave uh, aapko agar 80 se zyada mark lene hai to itna paisa itna paisa itna paisa and it is the ias officers who went to these places which put an end to it it is the ias officers mostly from outside the state who have come to that state and understood that this is the thing that is a termite deemak hai ye on civilization this is a deemak right it is the ias officer who comes and resolves this right and that's why even today it's very strict the enforcement of an exam in wind is very strict we everyone has to remove chappal belt my god i went to that space well, what is happening i've never seen exam centers like this right but that is required because we have to bring education back to its level and it was done it was done by an ias officer much senior to me in 2017 there is an ias officer called ileraja sir who really ended this he went school to school to school met principal after principal after principal met students after students after students then put his entire revenue and police force during the examination to patrol and then ended that culture and that's important that it ends that's not the tourism we want right so that is what and in between this you have to do this like which job offers you do? no nothing pds every month because we are a welfare the government so there is so many government schemes that run and these schemes are basically solving basic issues it's not just giving internet i mean that's also a basic issue it's giving food and if there is an issue and delay in this sdm is called upon first you have to go again you have to see the entire logistics of uh, uh, the food grains where it is going how it is coming and then what is the food security act you have to read laws and then see it whether it's going by law a lot of work right and these are people waiting for food this is then san mafia so this also tashan part where tashan can really go wrong right <laughs> yeah yeah this is that space yeah so this is uh, the san mafia there are three uh, there are three carwaies that revenue does i'm so sorry i'm using hindi because i love this part of hindi because it was new to me and i, I really felt 
there are three carvaies we do. We do avaid uh, udgaran pe carvai. This illegal mining carvai. Then avaid parivahan pe carvai. This illegal transport ka carvai and avaid bandaran pe carvai. This illegal storage carvai. All three is run by the SDM. And the most difficult is the avaid udgaran. You raid and go and raid mines. And these are places which have illegal weapons like in plenty. So you go with your team and the, the, they, they have informants everywhere to keep the information tight that nobody knows that we are going to this mine and raid today. Keeping the information tight, getting the force together, going in, going bravely to these areas, fighting. They, they, there are ships in between. They're called Pandupis. Nobody is supposed, if you know NGT, nobody is supposed to mine from the river bed. You can't put a boat there and suck uh, uh, sand out and spit it onto the uh, bank and then carry it. No. From the banks, you can mine. That's what is happening. So we go and get those Pandupis. They're called Pandupi in the, uh, it's Pandupi is a submarine. It's not exactly a submarine, but yeah. This is entirely new. It's, I, have a, I, have a, I have had a class in linguistics in Bind. Anyways, and this is Aved uh, Parivahan Pei. We stop trucks in the night. You go in the night at 9, 10, put Naka there, stop trucks. They won't stop at times. Please don't go after them. It's very difficult. Right? It's difficult not just for you. You might go in that tushan. In the end, who gets affected is a Sipai of yours, is a Patwari of yours. How would we account for that? Right? Please don't. You can stop a few, stop a few. Right, that's mostly it. Uh, that's mostly my work. This is the aesthetic of Bind. This is my house. I had a small house. I used to decorate it well. This is my collector's house. That's something in Bind. This is basically Bind. And this is this is the Talab in Bind. This is where I'm showing off my photography. I'm good. Yeah, so this is my, my driver, my collector's driver. And drivers are a very important entity. You'll understand once you get to the district. They are all in all. Uh, these, these are the police force I used to work with. This is my, uh, this is, these are kids in the Meet Mandi and this is my advocates and that's it, that's my routine. So it was really amazing. Aap IAS kyon banna chaate hain? Un saare sa waalo ka jawaab sirf Vivek ji ke pure jo journey hai, jo inhoan dikhaya. उसमें सारे सवालों के जवाब हैं कि आप आई क्यों बनना चाहते हैं अभी तक जो आपने प्रैक्टिकली कभी सोचा नहीं होगा कि आई बनने की वजहें क्या हैं वो सब आपने देख लिया है मैं एक सवाल आपसे जानना चाहता हूं कि जब हम तैयारी कर रहे होते हैं तो कुछ सर्टेन चीज़ें दिमाग में ऐसी होती हैं कि रिवोल्यूशनरी कोई चेंज आने वाला है समाज में ठीक है हम कुछ बदलने वाले हैं मतलब हर तैयारी करने वाले के मुँह से लगता है कि वो देश को बदल के रख देगा जिस दिन ही एज गॉड सेलेक्शन But after that, जब आप जाते हैं ट्रेनिंग पे पार्ट ऑफ ट्रेनिंग होता है आपका और इस तरह से आपकी जर्नी आगे बढ़ती है और फिर आपको समझ में आता है कि आप सिस्टम बनने नहीं जा रहे हैं या सिस्टम चेंज करने वाले नहीं जा रहे हैं बल्कि उस पूरे सिस्टम के उस पूरी मशीन का एक पार्ट है जी ठीक है जिसको हिंदी में कल पुर्जा बोलते हैं तो ये जो गैप है ये क्या आपके साथ भी रहा है और सिविल सर्विस के इम्पोर्टेंस को अगर इस गैप को भरने के हिसाब से इस मैच्योरिटी को गेन करने के हिसाब से इस ट्रेनिंग को देखें तो ये ट्रेनिंग कितना इम्पोर्टेंट है अपने आप में और आपने क्या फील किया इसके बारे में सी जस्ट टू गिव ए ब्रीफ अबाउट ट्रेनिंग ओके ट्रेनिंग हैपन्स इन टू फेसेस स्पेशली इन लबासना यू गो टू लबासना दर अ फाउंडेशनल कोर्स वेर ऑल अदर सर्विस ऑफिसर्स वुड बी देर एंड देन यू हैव योर फेस वन इन बिटवीन दिस बार दर्शन इज वंडरफुल दैट्स अ फेस वन देन यू आर सेंट टू डिस्ट्रिक्ट then you come back for phase 2 then you are uh, then you come to delhi after phase 2 you directly come to delhi as assistant secretaries and then you go back to your cadre this is the structure of training out of which i'm telling you where is the most valuable places now other services it depends now if you are looking for as uh, my as my, not everyone would be looking for as how many are looking for other services like ips who is looking for an ips excellent fs oh, nice foreign no oh, nice. so yeah so uh, and other service also uh, i'm not saying so if you are an as right i'm just coming from an as point of view other services will have their own dedicated training and they have they, they are structured i mean police would have a lot of training in crpc because they deal with it all the time right uh, the revenue service will have a lot of time with the revenue law uh, sorry uh, uh, the it act and all those things right the issue with the as it's an advantage and also an issue our training in our institute is general so you may get something out of it or may not get it, get something out of it and that's okay but the moment you come to district that's where your training starts and that is very important that is the extremely important thing if you have a good collector and a good driver your training will be excellent now why is training important one you start understanding ground level realities 
यू थिंक दैट यू गो देर एंड देन यू थिंक एक दिन में दो दिन में आप कुछ बदल पाओगे नो इट लैक्स लाइक अ रबर बैंड यू विल ट्राई डूइंग समथिंग एंड यू विल डू इट फॉर वन डे नेक्स्ट डे इट कम्स बैक देन यू गेट एंग्री एट पीपल बिकॉज यू कम फ्रॉम अ स्पेस दैट मैं तो हूं ऐसा ये क्यों नहीं है एंड दस नो पॉइंट आई यूज टू गेट एंग्री एट सो मेनी पीपल देन आई अंडरस्टैंड इट्स इट्स नॉट राइट इट्स जस्ट नॉट राइट सो also understand the places you go to, uh, go to are extremely rural the human resource that you are going to meet there will not have the capabilities which you have which you have seen in an urban uh, human resource they would not this, this is something i shared here also very funny also so uh, there was this thing that uh, everybody knows excel right so the basic copy paste thing is there so now uh, some excel came and uh, I, we had to prepare an excel i said i told someone to copy paste you aap uh, copy paste karke rakhiye main aa raha hu तो मैं वापस आ गया तो इट वॉज नॉट डन इट वॉज नॉट डन आई गॉट पेस्ट कि आपको कॉपी पेस्ट करना नहीं आता क्या कर रहे हो आप आप यहाँ पे कॉपी पेस्ट नहीं हो रहा एंड देन आई वेंट एंड माय कैबिन आफ्टर अ वाइल कॉफी केम टू मी द प्यून गॉट मी कॉफी इज व्हाट इज हैपनिंग आप बोल रहे हो कॉपी पेस्ट नहीं होती इट्स ट्रक मी देन इट रिली स्ट्रक मी आई मीन आई मीन इट्स इट्स लाइक इनिशियली आई वॉज आई नो शॉक बट इट्स माई इश्यू how would i expect such a force where we have not created schools we have not created technological education to understand this it's my issue and it's my issue because i come from a corporate space and i carry those prejudices and those entitlements then you understand then you drink that coffee first because these are sincere people they might they might not know they might be uneducated in the very conventional sense but they are sincere दे सिंसियर की साहब को गुस्सा आया है इस वजह से आया है हम उनको सुलझाएंगे कॉफी नहीं हो रही तो कॉफी बना दो दो मिनट में आ गई कॉफी है ना दिस आर सिंसियर हु वांट टू वर्क विथ यू एंड हु वुड लिसन टू यू एंड हु वुड थिंक दैट यू आर एवरीथिंग फॉर देम एंड दैट्स अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट थिंग सो प्लीज ड्रिंक दैट कॉफी गो एंड टीच दम दैट्स वॉट आई डेड आई वेंट एंड टॉट दम दिस इज कॉपी एंड दिस इज पेस्ट एंड दिस दैट सिंपल एंड देन वी ग्रेजुअली वेंट टू वी लुकअप दिस यू हैव टू बिल्ड योर ह्यूमन रिसोर्स यार it's not going to be given to you your reader does not know he will know a lot of things that you don't know all my revenue law someone say suchi banao i don't know what suchi is that's where i start hai na and these are the people suchi is list it seems yes yes and there are people the advocates are not good they, they, they scream at you things here aapko ye nahi aata then i really have to act aata hai and i look at my reader tension nahi so he tells me initially before going to a case he tells me सर ये ये चिल्लाएंगे आपको कुछ नहीं करना आपको हाँ बोलना है और आपको थोड़ा कम बात करना है हम इसके बाद डिस्कस करेंगे मैं लॉ दिखाऊंगा आपको हम डिस्कस करके इस फैसले पे लेके आएंगे है ना सो रीडर्स आर वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट दे माइट नॉट नो योर इंग्लिश दे माइट नॉट नो योर टेक्नोलॉजी बट दे आर द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट थिंग्स इन दैट स्पेस वेन यू हैव टू रिसॉल्व अ रेवेन्यू इश्यू दे आर द वंट एंड देर आर पीपल ट्राइंग टू पुट यू इन अ ट्रैप रीडर हेल्प्स तो उसकी भी नौकरी हमारे जुड़ी हुई है ना so that is very important to treat your human resource right don't look down upon them you are learning from them teach them also you know so these are things at a human level you learn bhai baki sab to kon nahi kisko nahi aata yaar tum se law to seekh hi loge kya hai isme kab se seekh rahe ho yaar in india examination has been such a horrible culture i am look at me like enough of exams and still i am thinking aur kuch baki hai kya that is the psyche we have it's sad it's a tragedy for a generation and a system that we only respect people who have cleared exams i am a middle class dream what else is it and still it's not right it's not right to give exams so much uh, weightage right it's not but sadly that's the reality that's something else we can't discuss it right now but understand you go and there are a lot of things you have to learn as a human because we have not stepped into the reality we have been only preparing studying preparing studying preparing that's what we have done so the most important thing i have learned in these spaces is to be tolerant to have patience to understand things doesn't happen quickly because if you are trying to make change and sustainable change that takes time that takes discipline that takes effort that take, that takes changing yourself changing your thinking process and making yourself more accessible humble and dedicated and at the same time understanding that you are an agent of change and not to give up on that system that ye to kuch nahi hoga yaar bolte rahenge yaar kitne log bolte hain in the first year itself the many people came and told me सर ये कुछ नहीं होने वाला ये नहीं होगा सर ये वो नहीं होगा एंड वी डोंट फाइट विद देम वी सेड हाँ यार हो नहीं पाएगा बट वी डोंट गिव अप वाइड यू हैव टू टेक रैंडम वॉर्स ठीक है यार आप जो बोल रहे हो वो सही है वी डोंट गिव अप वी डू इट एवरी डे एंड आउट ऑफ द टेन थिंग्स वी डू टू थिंग्स कम थ्रू दैट्स इनफ दैट्स इनफ एंड दैट्स नॉट वर्ल्ड चेंजिंग गेस वॉट 
It's not changing the world entirely, but it opens an alley. It's okay for a start. That's what I learned. You learn at a human level <laughs> rather than anything. Thank you. Okay, I got to know that uh, you are used to, to travel 25 kilometers for going to school. Or up village. So, how many people are village? Village backgrounds, in fact. But they are. And if you have a word, you will have a word. Because we have to say that we have to say village backgrounds. We have to say that 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 we have to to ये जर्नी कैसी थी आपकी पढ़ाई लिखाई जैसे 3 घंटे 4 घंटे अगर स्कूल जाने के लिए अब सोचने पर लगता है कि दैट वाज वेरी डिफिकल्ट और फिर एक गांव से निकलना एक विलेज से निकलना यहां बहुत सारे लोग आपको देखेंगे भी जो विलेज से हैं उनके लिए आईएएस बनना ये जर्नी कितनी आसान है कितनी टफ है पहले क्या सोचते थे आप जब जब उस समय स्कूलिंग करते तो सोचते थे कभी इस लेवल तक जाएंगे सी थैंक यू फॉर आस्किंग मी दैट क्वेश्चन uh, I am briefly saying about what I used to do. So my school was like 20 kilometers away from my house. So this is because my mother has a, a significant role to play in it. So she decided she wanted to educate me in the best school possible in that district. That's the maximum she can give. So that was 28 kilometers away. Though at times it was, just, uh, I find it difficult as a decision, but still it, it worked. So I used to take a bus to a train station and then a train and then another bus and all the way back. So one and a half through, one and a half back. Right. Uh, so one thing that uh, this gives you uh, is this, uh, some amount of understanding of the amount of time you have. Right. Ki kitna time up ke liye hai padne ke liye. And how would you maximize that utilization? Right. So one thing I will learn from childhood is how to work in a time limited space and get the maximum out of it. So somewhere because of this lifestyle that I started understanding the value of time and then making the most out of it. And now it really worked. You know, that has direct relevance to my work here. I used to work in Samsung and I am, I am a product manager. I was a product manager here. Work is not easy. They expect output out of you because you have been bought at that kind of a cost. The cost to acquire an IM resource and that too from ABC, it's high. There are expectations and you have to fulfill them. So my idea was in the given four hours, I'll work my max. I'll always come at nine and leave at five. Right? And, and I have to go back and study also. So this, this, this time management which I did in childhood somewhere came back to me. I understood bhai, isko karna hai. And, I, and then I used to, uh, that's why I managed a uh, preparation here. Initially, I, nobody thought of like with work and weekends preparation was extremely difficult. Like very few people could do it. I did not have an issue at all with it because my life has been that only. Be gaadi pe padho, train pe padho. Uh, bus pe padho, koi tension nahi. Mujhe koi fark nahi padta. There are people judging you. Uh, that's the world, yeah. What can you do? You know, judge to karenge hi karenge. Aap kuch bhi karlo. To karne do na. Aap to IAS banne wale ho. Mujhe no, karne do. So there will be people looking at you in train, see kya kar raha hai, wo kya kar raha I can see your heads turning in, not in a good fashion. But who cares? You know? So this is something that really helped me in preparation. So I'm telling you, I, I quit my work before I cleared it. But if I did not prepare those one and a half years when I was in Samsung, I will not have cleared this fast. I cleared the moment, the next year I cleared 5 RAS, the next year I cleared 5 RAS. But those days were extremely important. A lot of people told me, don't do it, do your work and let preparation take when you are all free, then prepare. Now there is no time to come. There is no time to come. And that's there with us also. Now there is an issue in the family, now there is an issue in the relationship, and all these are okay. To have a relationship, to have issues in the relationships, that's how human condition works. Please don't detest it. There are people who talk it down. Why you are dating, you don't have to deal with it. It's a bad thing, man. What you have to understand is to give things the right time it requires. Right? Uh, and hence, there will never be a space you are completely free to prepare for this exam. There will be something in your mind, there will be something in your mind, there will be something in your mind, there will be You should be extremely lucky and uh, you know, entitled to have entirely all the table clean and you are just preparing. That's an amazing space. I hope everyone has it, but people don't. So in that moment, in that time, irrespective of what your family is doing, going through, irrespective of what you're personally going through, what your relationship is going through, you have to take time out of this and dedicate it for the exam. And also understand, this exam does not work where you are studying. It doesn't happen, brother. It has gone to that level and it is, it's sad. Why? Because you have to study or you have to study. 
बीस में पढ़ के कोई कुछ नहीं होने वाला इफ यू हैव टू क्लियर यू हैव टू गिव इट एवरीथिंग अदरवाइज जस्ट डोंट गिव एनीथिंग वाई यू वेस्टिंग एंड लुक इट वॉट आर द टाइम यू आर वेस्टिंग द मोस्ट प्रोडक्टिव एंड द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट टाइम्स ऑफ योर लाइफ यू आर वॉट आर यू डूइंग दिस इज द यूथ माई गॉड इट इज द यूथ द ब्यूटी ऑफ द यूथ वॉट ऑल कांट यू डू इन यूथ राइट यू वुड ग्रेजुअली अंडरस्टैंड एवरीथिंग वुड चेंज द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट टाइम ऑफ योर लाइफ यू आर डेडिकेटिंग इट टू एन एग्जाम at some level i mean some other space it would be affable i mean i mean people would laugh at it but this is how our system is this is how society is sadly and you please understand the cost you are giving in one year now and one year after 10 years is a huge difference qualitatively please understand it when you push it and please dedicate yourself if that doesn't ten, get you tense right people ask me like uh, why you not motivated i mujhe motivation chahiye bhai mujhe motivation 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 should be there in you only that fear should motivate you you are losing the best part of your life with no skill develop what skill development is this there is no skill development here please don't think you are becoming an intellectual it's not it's very pedestrian knowledge that you learn there's no intellectual in it and you understand don't go deep understand the basic pedestrian things here and clear the exam that is the motto it is something that you have to clear it is you whether you enjoy it or not that's irrespective you enjoy your uh, so optional wow i i feel happy every day about it hence what Hence what? कोई फर्क नहीं पड़ता मेरे समवन हु कंप्लीटेड मुझे गुस्सा आता है पढ़ने में तुमसे ज्यादा मार्क ले आए यार तुम एंजॉय करते रह गए बढ़िया कीप कीप सेवर इन अंडरस्टैंड दिस अंडरस्टैंड प्लीज डोंट टेक दिस एग्जाम एज एन इंटेलेक्चुअल स्पेस सडनली आप यूपीएससी में प्रेयर कर रहे हो किसी से भी बात कर रहे हो मुझे ये पता है वो पता है यू नो वेरी बेसिक यू नो वे फॉर थिंग स्टफ एंड दोस्ट पीपल डोंट नो एनी थिंग सो यू आर एट एन एडवांटेज आई डोंट ब्लेम यू माई कॉर्पोरेट पीपल डिट नो नथिंग they knew only about apps and what's happening in the technology space and some uh, ceos here and there not that that uh, that uh, information is any worse less but fine that's all they require you suddenly know the finance commission and what the budget entails and suddenly they all look up to you but you know nothing please we know only basic article pata hai char point pata hai gs ke liye aur conclusion pata hai yaar please so and and please understand that's all that's the only thing you require <laughs> that's the only thing you require and that's the only thing you should be knowing Please don't go deeper into these things if they are enjoyable. If you are a good student, I I was a very good student. So I am pushing a bit here still. Uh, so I was a very good student. I used to enjoy. Then I understood. No, why? You clear it. You come to the service. Start enjoying everything. No. What is the tragedy here? Yeah, we are so enjoyable and so enthusiastic the, to clear this exam. The moment we clear it, we are chill. Okay. <laughs> That is how the incentives are very weird in this country. that academic uh, pull that agency and that passion should be after the service this is an exam we have everything here and most of us have nothing on the other side ho gaya ab to yahi so to hona hi chahiye na to waise bhi hu kai ab that sad and you go and say you are an as officer or any other officer people look up to you oh, no not all as officers are saying right So please reserve that for after the job. Please don't lose interest. This thing you can only do if you have passion. To go at forty nine degrees and look at drainage. My God, the amount of sunscreen I have to put. <laughs> yeah, and that too didn't save me much. Imagine you need that kind of motivation and passion, and that too you are there for one year. You are going out, going out. अब थोड़ी बाहर रहने वाले हो. आपको थोड़ी political clout मिल रही है कुछ. वो election में खड़े होने का कुछ नहीं मिल रहा भाई. अगले posting, अगला काम. है ना तब सुबह उठना सीखो यार अभी तो एग्जाम का तो डर है ना तब ही सुबह उठना सीखो तो उठते ही नहीं है ना सुबह फिर दैट इज वेर वी नीड इट शिफ्ट इट देयर प्लीज अंडरस्टैंड दिस एग्जाम है ना एंड देन मूव थैंक यू चलिए आप में से कोई सवाल पूछना चाहते हैं हैंड रेज करे भाई कोई भी कुछ भी पूछ सकता है लेकिन पूछ सकते हैं मतलब एक्चुअली uh, आपने पहला अटेम्प्ट आई एम के साथ दिया था आपने जैसा बताया नहीं नहीं जॉब के साथ दिया था हाँ आई एम सॉरी आई एम के बाद जो जॉब मिला था उसके हाँ साथ दिया था ठीक है उसके बाद आपने जॉब का रिजाइन किया था सेकेंड अटेम्प्ट के लिए तो मतलब दोनों में क्या क्या थिंकिंग डिफरेंस थे सी Uh, why did I lose, uh, leave the job? Now that is not a disinterested incentive for someone who is working, working and clearing. There are people who have worked and cleared. I couldn't. That's sad. But uh, you can clear it with work. I stand by it. Right? Given uh, the, uh, I clear, uh, I left my job because the moment, the by the time I came to prep, I was pretty old. Right? I I, I did my MBA and then worked and then came. So it doesn't make sense for me to prolong this pre uh, uh, preparation at all. Right? It's affecting my work. 
and also i if i i wanted to know if i leave everything and prepare for one year would it work if it if it doesn't i'll go back to private right i had that option that's why i quit and now your question what is the difference between these two the good things i'll tell you one without work it is easier it's sad but it is easier if you can resign if you have that economic uh, condition please do i would say please do it's my personal opinion you can take second opinion on this but please do because this exam has become that complicated look at the prelims here what is it what what is it testing that's the sad part what is it testing that whether you can mug up facts sadly yes that's what it testing and that again comes to that point please mug up please don't think mugging up is be below you again that intellectual thing suddenly rise up in you know no mug up please and, and in in the right manner and then the right things fine so where was ha the difference is you have dedicated time right you have dedicated time you have a better lifestyle yeah you have to go to gym you have to go I, i used to go to gym only before like one month before mains i would uh, uh, not go right otherwise i used to go to gym i used to go out and watch a movie once in a while these are important aspects of human life here hai na but what happens with work is if i study if i study with work i am losing all the human elements i sometimes turn up of into the office as very uncouth and very un you know the dress and all doesn't match up to the corporate standards right so that is an issue i started having that breathing space and that was very important for me to uh, attempt the exam with lesser stress that's one secondly now uh, what also happens is uh, with when you get closer to mains agar aap hosh mein ho to padhna chahiye that's what i believe अदरवाइज यू कैन मैनेज योर वर्क आज देर इज नो वन यार ऐसे बोलते हैं ना मैं नौ घंटे पढ़ा दिस आर ऑल एवरी डे आई स्टडी फॉर टेन ट्वेल्व आवर्स आई थिंक मोस्ट ऑफ द माई लाइज आई फील सो मे बी देर आर पीपल हू डू इट एंड दिस इज नॉट सस्टेनेबल यू कैन सस्टेन दैट पुश ओनली वेन यू आर क्लोजर टू दैट एग्जाम एंड दैट इज ओनली टाइम शुड भी सस्टेन अदरवाइज यू शुड पुट द मोस्ट इफेक्टिव नंबर ऑफ आवर्स वेर योर स्टडी इज प्रिटी गुड एंड देन क्लोज इट देर राइट so hence we are closer to mains it's always good to have a lot of time because revision revision is everything in this ek to revise itni bar karo yaar tumhare na ragon mein gul jaye na ragon mein daudne firne ke liye humne hi kaha wo hai ye ha to jab ci se na tapke to fir lahu kya hai that is the thing ha to i made it ci for the exam <laughs> i know uh, thank you uh, so so yeah so where was this ha huh. so hence that's another thing for when you closer to mains either take a long leave or disappear from office it's okay it'll man it'll get undone theek hai you can't manage both yaar you can't manage your image in the office and the image for upsc it will go down and let it be theek hai baad mein le dekh lenge so that is another thing but what is wrong with quitting office i became less efficient then i had more time in four hours i used to learn much more there now i am a bit hmm. that is the difference and i think i think uh, quitting helped I would say I'm so sorry, but I would say my quick help. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Hello, sir. Good afternoon. My name is Satyam Divedi. Hai. And my sir, a question is that you have passed out from NIT. After that, you came to IIM. After that, you became an IAS. So, for a child, you have become an ideal child. Ah, it's a pain. That from this, just that you have become like that, you have not become like that. And sir, in their case, what should you do? Who should you do? Who should you do? Who should you do? Who should you do? और सर उनके लिए क्या करना चाहिए जिन्होंने ट्वेल्थ में ट्वेल्थ में सिर्फ टाइम पास किया जॉब किया एंड उसके बाद फिर एक वो नीली बत्ती वाली गाड़ी देखी पुलिस को देखा एंड उसके बाद मोटिवेटेड होके आई की जर्नी में आ गए एंड सर तो उसके लिए कोई सजेशन आपके लिए कैरेक्टर आप खुद तो नहीं है यस सो थैंक यू फॉर आस्किंग मी दैट see one thing uh, i just go back to that point of exams right i am a middle class dream it's sad i don't want to be it is something that is in me ingrained in me ki aap exam clear karo clear karo clear karo and doesn't mean happiness yeah not that i'm not happy but it's just an unsustainable manner uh, in some way of do- dealing with things i went through exams after exams my biggest issue was boredom in engineering i shouldn't have done i was not a good engineer but i cleared it because that was the only things lot of times in our childhood and all these things are these, these are two things you see like medicine and engineering you choose one and go ahead then i did mba because i did like it and then i came to the as see since it's upsc right there is an inherent i always feel there is an inherent uh, justice in upsc right there are people in of your uh, format there's nothing wrong with it it's totally okay you decide when to study yaar yeah? people should understand this the middle class does not understand this at all sadly 
we are, we are all uh, uh, they, they, they think uh, from first standard to 10th standard to plus 2 you have to top what a what a horrific uh, ambition isn't it and that top so it doesn't matter it doesn't matter you didn't top right but what really matters is that at one point in your life you decided that enough of this life there's nothing wrong with it enough of this life i would like this life that decision has to be made thoroughly and what is the difference in that decision between you and me? I'm being very honest here. Uh, please don't take it wrongly. What is the difference between me and you in that thing? Is that I might be more systematized. Because I've already seen competition. That is the only advantage I have. Otherwise, you, for, for UPSC and all, there's nothing. UPSC has an inherent justice in it. It does not care for the, uh, the subtleties in your language. Nobody cares. I had the worst marks when I wrote beautiful, I mean, uh, tougher vocabulary. I had the worst marks. Then I had to reduce it. Right? It is not an exam for the intelligence. You don't need intelligence. You need some amount of ordinary stuff only. And a direction and hard work. That is what is required. Now, the difference is this. If you are someone who has suddenly rose up to, I mean, uh, woken up to competition, suddenly so you are a person who have decided to crack an exam. You might not know what an exam requires and how to crack an exam. That you will have to learn. I have seen too many exams. And even then I took time. You might clear it in the first attempt. Thank you, sir. Uh, sir, should we consider our data that what we have achieved in our 12th or, 12th or in graduation? Or just that you have you have a mind, you have a mind, you have a mind. Yes, that's enough. That's enough. 10th and 12th are history, hai. who cares? What did you top in 12th? You learned differential equations. Where are you using it? My God, differential equations. For what? Yeah, imagine, our education system has real issues. Differential equations. I've never seen them after that. So 12th and all doesn't matter, but what matters is your determination to clear this exam and secondly, not just uh, blind hard work. Are you ready to listen to people, listen to the right people and mend your, modulate your preparation? Are you ready to believe in yourself and also work in a particular direction? And what is important is syllabus and question papers here. I don't know how many times your people should tell you this. Look at them. There will be all kinds of coaching stuff telling you this and that. What is your core? What does that UPSC given you? Syllabus and question papers. If you have not, I'm sure there are multiple people in here. You have not seen the syllabus. Please go read it. Please go read the question paper and understand which direction you should move. Then take help here and there. That's what. Thank you, sir. Thank you, Thank you so much. Now, the hands are growing. There is no one who doesn't get up for singing. Then all the people come to sing. Thank you for coming. Sir, my first question is, sir, what did you use in men's writing? <laughs> no, 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 no. I'm so sorry. That's a real question. You know, sir, I used to laugh at this question long back. When I started writing, then I understood. Yeah. Sir, the question is, sir, what was optional? Why did you decide to decide? Yeah, thank you. Yeah, good, background? good. 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 Two things. One might look pedestrian and you think it's irrelevant, but no. Once you start writing your mains, no, you would understand. You need a pen that gives you enough friction so that you have control on your handwriting and enough uh, smoothness so that it goes fast. That is the idea. That is the trade-off here. Right? In a very science perspective, sorry. But that is the trade-off. Uh, your handwriting requires a significant amount of friction for that to have character for other people to sit down. No issues. For other people to read it. Right? Right? It should be legible. The friction gives legibility. Right? Secondly, if you are way too legible and you're not, like, uh, you have done uh, like 15 questions very well, 5 questions you have done. No tension. It's not that. Clear to not. It's good. It's written. That is the issue. So you have to choose a pen that suits you for this. But these are the trade-offs. I'm just telling you the trade-offs. Now try with multiple pens. I used uh, V5. Yeah, because I wanted a, a thinner uh, letter, right? I don't want thick, uh, uh, thick, what do you say, the bolder font. So I wanted a thinner letter and also the face. And uh, V5 is good. I think it works. But a lot of people use some kind of ball pens also. But try it. In mock test, you change pens and try. Right, mock tests are very important. You will, this is a, for a later point in time. Please write mock tests in the given amount of time. Take that pain. If you stop in between, chai pee ke aa jayenge na, khatam hai fir. Fir kuch nahi ho raha. You have to feel that pressure. Otherwise, kuch nahi ho raha. Agar mock tests mein pressure nahi feel ho, to waha ka pressure kisi kaam ka nahi hai. Please understand that. The second question was, sorry. Uh, sub, uh, uh, optional. Optional is three things. So, the, how do you choose an optional? So, I am from an MBA thing. So, I have these structural things which are, okay, not every time it works. Three things. One, you look at an intersection with GS. Right, whether the optional helps with GS or not. Secondly, you look at whether you are interested in the subject or not. Right, can you do you have the capability to learn it? Third, uh, what I look at whether it has institutional help. I could have taken management or electronics and communication, I didn't take any of them because I was not really good at it, but still, uh, my uh, I was preparing with work, 
So I have wanted something that was cogent, that syllabus was defined and contained, not too much, right? It had institutional help. So thirdly, it had intersection with GS. I took sociology, right? But there are people who take mathematics and still score very high. Just that something has an intersection with GS doesn't mean it always helps. If you can really score in one subject, please take it. So interest becomes an important player here. But these are the three things you should be looking at while choosing your optional, right? Uh, good morning, sir. Sir, I wanted to ask about two phases that you had. One, when you prepared along with the job and the other, uh, when you left the job. Sir, so, so similar situation is with me. I found that without job, my efficiency has been lost. My, I, have, I am putting less amount of hours, uh, unsurprisingly and unfortunately. Or, uh, and how to co cope up with this? Because it is taking up into my mind that I should not have uh, left the job. Or, wo backfire kar hai, ye decision ki mein job chhod diye, aur meri efficiency kam ho gayi hai, although it is uh, since only one to two months only. Understood. Uh, understood, understood, understood. That's the question, no? Understood. Good. Uh, so, uh, one thing, uh, there are other people also who have left jobs. One, your decision is not wrong. A decision has been taken here. Now, though, uh, there's no point thinking about it. Though that, that's a sunk cost. Fine, the decision is right. Please, rem please remember, even if it is wrong, it's, it's okay. It is right. That confidence you have. This is the confidence you have when you see a, a question, you don't know anything. Like you see questions in mains that you don't know anything. You never heard anything about it. Something on quantum mechanics and they'll ask. But you have to think this, you have to think it. And it's not just that it comes to the point. And it comes to the point. You will, you will write it and you will get two marks. That's enough. Exam hai na, PhD thodi hai. Hum, hum nikal lengi bhi paper. That conference is required. So quitting the job is right. Irrespective of what you think about it, you have to believe that it is right and it is right, I have quit my job. Secondly, the efficiency thing. Yeah, you should be feared of, uh, fearful of two things. One is the idea that you are young and you're, 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 right, you're putting it in. You have something called an opportunity cost also, no? You are skilled. You could have been somewhere else and you'd be earning money also. And that should really push you. So now, uh, those are the things, but how do you program them? Now, when you had only four hours, you're always awake and fighting. Now it will not happen. You have to come up to the fact that that kind of efficiency cannot be brought in now. Maybe it will come towards mains, but that kind of efficiency cannot be brought in now. You divide the day three, 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 and make those three hours counts. In between, I don't know exactly that solution. I'm sorry, that's not a really adequate answer. Thank you, thank you so much. No issue. सर मेरा नाम अभिषेक मिश्रा है गुड आफ्टरनून सर सर मेरा क्वेश्चन ये है कि जो वर्किंग प्रोफेशनल है तो उसके लिए क्या स्ट्रेटजी होनी चाहिए कि वो अपने वर्किंग के थ्रू वर्किंग के दौरान अपना प्रिपरेशन सही से कर सके ठीक है ठीक है आई आई आंसर दैट फास्ट वर्किंग क्वेश्चन पहले पहली स्ट्रेटजी ये है आपका वर्क एफेक्ट होगा इसमें कोई इशू नहीं है आप डांट खाओगे इसमें कोई इशू नहीं है दैट इज द फर्स्ट स्ट्रेटजी कि डांट खाओ और सॉरी बोलो हम गलत कर रहे हैं कोई टेंशन नहीं कोई टेंशन इट्स इट्स और बेटर गुड for everything, right? So, one, you don't try to save more jobs and there's enough and more job security for everyone, yaar. Hai na? Aise koi nahi nikale, nikale ga, par thoda baut to dakhe khane padenge ek. Secondly, uh, see your officers, right? If you're a client dependent job, that becomes very tricky. Then your calls and all are in the night, right? So, if you're not a client dependent job, you have officers, maintain your officers tight. At 5 o'clock, you're allowed to go. A lot of people stay after 5 to please your bosses and uh, to make sure that people see that you're working and stuff and stuff and stuff. Irrespective of what your boss says. Boss will come and say, you're going to go quickly. I'll say, yes sir, what are you doing? Sir, we have to stay here. No, we won't say that, but inside you should know. <laughs> sir, we are going to go in two years. What are you doing? You're in sales. Mein ho aap. That's how it is. But please understand, get ready for some uh, insult and be okay with it. I mean, district will eat in the district. I mean, farmers will abuse you only. And it's okay. Just be okay with it. Initially, I used to get angry. Then I understood that there's nothing. No tension. Listen to it. Yeah, that's exactly what it is. Anything else? Sir, current affairs ko kaise handle kare? Yeah, yeah. Uh, I'll put a caveat here. My preparation was in 2019 and this is a very dynamic preparation. Whatever I say might have changed. Right? It's that fast. And that's why you need institutions which are pretty much like this institution maybe which who are pretty much up with the game. It's, that's why the coaching institutions are still important because of the dynamic nature of it. That we can't hold it. Someone who's continuously seeing that paper only can. So, what, what did I do for current affairs? Uh, two things, uh, three things actually. One is get current affairs wala booklets, no? Whichever institution you like, right? Ha, whatever, monthly ones. Monthly ones, whichever you like, that's your preference. I'll leave it to you. I wouldn't say a particular thing. But please do it thoroughly every month. I used to have current affairs notes. They had nothing common, random things. Suddenly, it's, it's a polar beer, some fact. Next fact is about agriculture. That is how related they are. And that is the 
horror of current affairs useless sorry so sorry to say it but it is the most useful for the exam in life it is useless but most useful for the exam because those current affairs would also serve as your examples in mains you would not have to go and search for examples your current affairs notes would do it now do one coaching institution's current affairs thoroughly and thoroughly and thoroughly do another coaching institution's question papers and then see how where you are and revise it again and again it's the most pedestrian useless fact but the most important fact good afternoon sir mm. uh, sir how to manage pressure during the uh, preparation mm. or how to manage time table yeah, yeah 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 i understand where you're coming from please sir what is the role of plan b during the preparation ah, a good question sit down uh, so uh, pressure as such pressure how do you manage it here one is you need some emotional support right this can be a family your girlfriend boyfriend it's totally fine right that emotional support is required someone who tells you that it's okay you're doing well even when you're not it's very important that someone tells you right right and that is one way to cope up pressure i used to watch movies which, which might not be for everyone i am uh, i like movies so i i have seen a lot of cinema that's why i know hindi also uh, so that's another that, that's a personal thing but so always someone who is outside prep hai na bhai competition mein to tum thodi matlab it's very difficult unless you that good friends uh that tum theek kar rahi ho it's very difficult here it's a very murky space it's very competitive people are jealous we know this and that so always have someone outside the prep who is your close friend or family whom you can call and talk to that's one way to deal with pressure secondly getting used to pressure yaar that's very important you are in sgm i so showed you 10 things in one day now you have to it's a basic socialization thing in that's the best thing about upsc i think it just makes you okay with pressure theek hai ye sab to humne dekh hi liya aur aur kya ho sakta hai theek hai that's okay We are taking last question of the session. सर को कहीं जाना है तो आपके क्वेश्चन के साथ खत्म करेंगे ठीक है फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल गुड आफ्टरनून सर एंड थैंक यू फॉर ब्रीफिंग ऑफ अस अबाउट ऑल द वर्क यू हैव डन सो माई क्वेश्चन इज लाइक वी हैव हर्ड इट ऑफ इन दैट दिस इज लाइक एट मंथ्स वन ईयर टू ईयर दिस इज द राइट टाइम ऑफ प्रेपरेशन फॉर योर प्रेपरेशन सो वट इज योर ओपिनियन ऑन इट लाइक इज देर एनी राइट टाइम फॉर द प्रेपरेशन नो 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 सॉरी सॉरी गुड क्वेश्चन uh yeah there's no right time as such you decide when you start you start I mean, i'll tell tell you what it is what is now no what is now it's closer to mains no that's what so if you're starting now you should look at the cycle of upsc at least when you start you can start any time so what is the next closest thing prelims which is far away isn't it prelims is where in june that's where it is may to now okay great thank you for being so precise uh yeah so so that's where it is now so prelims is far so this and prelims you need uh, if you are a newcomer right if you if you if you if you just come you have never you have never seen current affairs never done the foundational wala prelims from a prelims perspective you need let's say from january right so if you are starting now you go full uh, overdrive on your optional and gs mains right you stop it irrespective of where you are by december end whether you have completed optional whether you have uh, uh, completed your gs paper doesn't matter from january if you are a new guy into the prep please start if you already done one prelims you have cleared that prelims cleared it not just studied for prelims hua nahi wo to kuch nahi mayne nahi rakhta yaar clear honi chahiye hai na so uh, if you are someone that get to february mid february mid is okay for starting for prelims but you have to start so this is how it is if you are starting let's say in february you know what to do you just study prelims and try getting to that prelims and then study mains right look at the cycle you can start any time plus please look at the cycle and adjust accordingly thank you so much sir yeah okay i hope ki ye session aap log ke liye wonderful raha hoga badhiya raha hoga thoda zor se boliye to sunai pade yes sir kya aap chahenge ki aise session aage bhi ho yes sir okay aur sir se milke kaisa laga bahut acha ye ab jo feel aa raha hai na jaise school ke bacche bolte hai yes sir <laughs> or in, sorry i'm so sorry yes, yes. if you if you want to like please i'm not very active on any other thing if you want to have uh, ping me something some specific doubts we're not pretty introverted to ask in a class you can ping me on my instagram you can find my instagram you can ping on the message box i will reply give me like 2 3 days always i will reply thank you so much instagram par jaise aap dalenge kvvek underscore ias that is the idea uh, yeah the plan b question i'll just answer that it's always good to have a plan b Uh, I I had a plan B in private. It's just in a thought. कि क्या करना चाहिए? Thought. Don't work too much on it. This is plan A, plan B, plan C, everything here. Let's see it in that manner. है ना? ठीक है. और ये last में एक सवाल मैं पूछ ही लेता हूँ. ये important सवाल है. हमने सिर्फ बातचीत की कि 
लेट्स होप ये सारे लोग सेलेक्ट हो जाए बट ऐसा होगा नहीं ठीक है तो वट इज द इम्पोर्टेंस ऑफ प्लान बी क्या प्लान बी अभी से सोचना चाहिए या जब होगा तो देखेंगे सी अ फ्यू थिंग्स यार आई जस्ट टेल यू वेरी नेकेड ट्रूथ्स अबाउट दिस एग्जाम दिस एग्जाम डज नॉट हैव एन एफर्ट टू आउटपुट को रिलेशन आई हैव रिटर्न ऑल एग्जाम्स इन दिस कंट्री एंड ऑलवेज देर इज एन एफर्ट टू आउटपुट को रिलेशन दिस सैडली डज नॉट हैव इट विच इज इरिटेटिंग यार देर इज अ लक फैक्टर विच प्लेस इट डज नॉट प्ले राइट नाउ वेन यू हैव डन नथिंग दैट्स नॉट लक दैट्स बिकॉज यू हैव डन नथिंग इट कम्स इन टू प्ले ओनली वेन यू हैव स्टडीड वेरी वेल यू आर स्कोरिंग वेल इन योर मॉक टेस्ट यू आर क्लियरिंग मेन्स एंड इन इन द लिस्ट यू नॉट देर you are not there in the list continuously for 2 3 years yaar whether we to go on or not you get really tired it's a heartbreaker exam it takes your toll on you right i am a very qualified person i'm very confident it did affect me largely i got so scared at one point when my rank was not good enough to get an as and i thought that i have to prepare this thing again read prelims facts again my god it got into my bones but then you come back that's what you are right that's what you are here that's what you are you know to do every time you have been down you have always come up and you'll fight and get it and i got it secondly also understand when to pull the plug continuously you're doing it doing it it's not working everything you have tried pull it out yaar it's okay it's not the end of the world and this job also is a job you know the best thing in the world not to have a job and then live that is the best thing in the world like there are rich people sons and daughters like that i'm jealous of them please don't judge them they have the best life in the world you still have to do a job to get, do a living how are prestigious and good and what it what not it is right so understand this is a job at the end of the day move on move on to better things look down upon it it's okay there are i know my friends who have done much better earns more than me i have these chats in one once in a while people look at me and laugh but that's it <laughs> otherwise it's a job it's an everyday thing it's a, it's a very routine job it is not in once you go to district you will understand you have so many papers it's boring the tuition happens once in 3 months yaar or 4 months so never happens <laughs> it's true but you have you are there and you are learning that's good enough for me okay ye vakai mein bahut hi shandar session tha itne acche se baat chit hui ki Uh, एक आई की जर्नी से सीखने को बहुत सारी चीज़ें जो मिलती हैं वो मिली जनरली हम जब बात करते हैं किसी सेट किसी टॉपर से किसी आई से तो हम ऊपर ऊपर बात करते हैं तैयारी कैसी होनी चाहिए ये होना चाहिए बट जब हम ये जर्नी देखते हैं तो समझ में आता है कि आई होने का मतलब क्या है समझ में आता है कि आपके सिलेबस को किस हिसाब से डिज़ाइन किया गया है जब वो देखते हैं कि बुलडोजर लेकर ये पहुँचे हुए हैं और मलबा साफ कर रहे हैं तो डिजास्टर मैनेजमेंट क्यों पढ़ाया जा रहा है ये आपको तब को रिलेट होगा जब ये जर्नी आप समझेंगे और इसके प्रैक्टिकल अप्रोच को समझेंगे तो थैंक यू सो मच आपने इतनी सारी बातें की इतना ज्यादा वक्त दिया थैंक्स अलॉट थैंक यू थैंक यू ठीक है आप लोग आप लोग पंद्रह मिनट का ब्रेक लीजिए फिर हम फैकल्टी मीट करेंगे आप और फैकल्टी से आप वन टू वन क्वेश्चन जो भी पूछना हो करेंगे सर को हम लोग विदा करते हैं और नेक्स्ट सेशन में फिर कभी फिर जरूर बुलाएंगे क्योंकि आपसे इंटरेक्शन इतना अच्छा रहा और इतने प्रैक्टिकल बातें आपसे सीखने को मिली थैंक यू ओके बाय बाय स्टडी आई क्यू अब तैयारी हुई अफोर्डेबल